All right, this will be a quick tutorial on how to connect an LN100 via Wi-Fi to a computer, your laptop, or your tablet uh, with a little bit of troubleshooting involved. So if you have an LN100, uh, have it on. Uh, obviously, it will output a Wi-Fi signal, a Wi-Fi network name. You can hit connect. Typically, the password is a 00 following uh, by the serial number of your unit. Hit next. Your computer will connect to uh, this device, but you will see that it'll say there's no internet connection. If it asks for a exception to a, a firewall, like it is uh, doing for me, just accept the exception for the firewall so that your computer doesn't complain or the tablet or whatever you're connecting, but we're now connected. You will notice that if we have a Wi-Fi profile loaded in our magnet, uh, field layout or magnet field uh, software uh, when you hit the optical connection and you hit connect what might happen is you'll be struggling to understand why did it not actually find the LN100 if it's the first time that you've connected to it what the LN100 requires is a power off and a power on so let me actually turn off my LN100 All right, it's powered off. You'll see that soon enough the network connection will be dropped. There we go. Now the connection is established to our uh, training center. Turn the LN100 back on. And as soon as the computer actually now recognizes the now existing LN100 connection without you prompting it to connect, you will see that it'll just connect to it automatically if you check the automatic connection to it. It has to re-level, so you know it takes about a minute for it to come back on. Let's see if the connection's there yet. There we go, the LN100 just popped up again. It says connect in, and it is connected already. So if I go back here and just refresh, you'll notice that it'll now pop up in the list, highlight it, hit select. Now we're connected to the LN100, and you can go ahead and proceed with your actual setup. It's always nice to just double check that it's actually working by turning the LN100 or you know just operating it remotely. But without that power off and power on in between, you might find it a little tricky to actually connect to it. Upon next connection, this is not going to be uh, necessary. It's just the very first time you ever connect. You will have to connect in Windows, power off, power back on, let it reconnect automatically, and then magnet field will be ready to connect to the instrument.